36, verses 5 through 10. Your steadfast love, O Lord, extends to the heavens, your faithfulness to the clouds. Your righteousness is like the mighty mountains, your judgments are like the great deep. You save humans and animals alike, O Lord. How precious is your steadfast love, O God. All people may take refuge in the shadow of your wings. They feast on the abundance of your house, and you give them drink from the river of your delights. For with you is the fountain of life. In your light we see light. O oh, continue your steadfast love to those who you know, who know you, and your salvation to the upright of heart. Matthew 10, 5 and 16 through 31. Jesus sent out the twelve after giving them the following instructions. I'm sending you out like sheep among wolves. So be as wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Be on your guard. People will haul you into court. They will flog you in the synagogues. For my sake, you'll be dragged before rulers and governors as witnesses to them and to the Gentiles. When they hand you over, don't worry about how to speak or what to say. You'll be given what you should say when the time comes. Because it is not you speaking, but the spirit of your Abba God speaking through you. Sibling will betray sibling to death and parents their children. Children will rise up against their parents and have them executed. Everyone will hate you because of me. But whoever stands firm until the end will be saved. When you are persecuted in one place, flee to another. The truth is, you will not have visited all the towns of Israel before the promised one comes. A student is not superior to the teacher. The follower is not above the leader. The student should be glad simply to become like the teacher, the follower like the leader. If the head of the house has been called Beelzebul, how much more the members of the household? Don't let people intimidate you. Nothing is concealed that will not be revealed, and nothing is hidden that will not be made known. But I tell you, in shadows, speak in the light. What you hear in private, proclaim from the housetops. Don't fear those who can deprive the body of life, but can't destroy the soul. Rather, fear the one who can destroy both the body and the soul in Gehenna. Are not the sparrows sold for pennies? Yet not a single sparrow falls to the ground without your Abba God's knowledge. As for you, every hair on your head has been counted. So don't be afraid of anything. You are worth more than an entire flock of sparrows. Amen.